story and welcome welcome so i'm back again with another live dollar tree and this time it's a 99 cent store haul as well because we went on vacation last week and there was a 99 cent store there so i bought some things from there but yeah this is everything since my last dollar tree haul so it's quite a bit of stuff and i have you guys on um my phone again but last time the audio was not very good like on the replay so if you're in the live chat now and you cannot hear me very well please let me know so that I can pipe up so that it's easier to see and let me get this squared away so that I can like read your comments as they come because the first time I missed a ton of comments so yeah let me see if I can oh there it is right there perfect hi guys so good to see you blondie warrior i just saw you commented on one of my videos thanks for always watching um let's just go ahead and jump on into the haul the first thing i got are i feel so bad about wrappers they're like so noisy but i got five packages of the silver napkin rings you guys have seen me um use these before for tons of different projects hi guys i'm so glad you guys are here I love all of the love. Thank you so much. This is like, I get so excited chatting with you guys like this because it feels more real to me. But hello from Georgia, the South. It's a little late there in Georgia, isn't it? Oh, you can't hear very well. I'll try to speak up. I'm glad you said something though because last time people could not hear me very well at all. Please let me know if it's better now. I feel like I'm shouting, but if it helps you guys. Okay, so ooh, Toronto, Canada. Welcome, welcome guys. You can barely hear me. Ah, I'll try to be so loud. <laughs> Let me know if it gets better, please. Um, you never see these rings. Okay, so I only found them at like one of my nine stores. And then I went to a different um, one that's like a little further from my location. And they had just barely stocked up on them. So I got a bunch more, like five packs, as you can see. Because I am so afraid. Okay, Arkansas can hear me. If you can hear me all the way in Arkansas, I think we're good now. Thank you so, so much, Peggy. Okay, so I was saying um, they just stocked up on all of these, so I bought them because I am terribly afraid that they're going to be like um, those mysterious little silver plates and just never come back again and be seasonal. So I stocked up on those because the one that I bought them from normally, just like they disappeared all of a sudden. So yeah, those are those. Excuse me for bending down, please. Okay, next up, I'm trying to keep track of all your comments. Okay, hey, Kansas can hear me, thank goodness. My blood is in Kansas, so welcome, welcome. A San Diego, jealous. So I got some candles. These ones are like, I think these are the, the emergency ones. Like I don't think these are necessarily for decor, but these are a little bit shorter than like the regular um, tall tapered candles. So I got six pack of those ones. Next up, I got some clothes pins, and I'm not sure if I'm gonna be needing these. I'm going to use these to, um, uh, hold a project together while the E6000 dries. So I'm gonna try these out. If they don't work, I might have to use twist ties or something. So I just picked those up for that. And then I got these salt and pepper shakers. Okay, so Ashley Hobbs, she does Dollar Tree hauls too. And she mentioned in one of her videos that she takes one of these and then she puts um, those wax melts inside of it and then puts it in her car. So then in the summertime, when it gets hot, it melts the, the wax melt and then it smells good in your car. I'm gonna give that a shot. I am so excited about that. So thank you, Ashley. That's why I got the salt and pepper shakers. Next up, I got um, another package of these little clear tea light candle holders, and um, these have been coming back. I was worried that these might be a seasonal thing, so yeah, I got these back, and um, what was I gonna say about these? Oh, they had different colors. I finally saw all the different colors, so yeah, but these have been restocking, so thank goodness. The first time I saw them, I like, bought a ton because I wasn't sure if they were gonna come back or not, so hopefully those will be a regular fit at the Dollar Tree. Next up, I got some more of these candles. I'm thinking about doing a video of like showing you guys how I take um, regular Dollar Tree candles and like spice them up a little bit, so I bought these and those other candles. Maybe that's kind of like a might do. I don't know, you guys let me know. So that's why I got those, and then I got four packages of these clear shower curtain rings so I had bought two for one project I had in mind but then um, as I was mapping out the project that I wanted to do I didn't have enough and so I needed more and I went to the store that I had originally bought the original two packages from and they were they were not there sorry they were not there and so I had to run around all my nine stores and I only found four packages of all those stores so I bought all four of them because I don't know if I'm gonna see them again so yeah those are those and then I got one LED push light and just one because I already have some others for the other project so you can do a candle votive 
sorry if I'm missing your comments. There's so many of you in here today. It's like overwhelming. Trying to make dinner. Ooh, we had waffles for dinner. What are you having for dinner, Melissa? Um, I found one more package of these, and this is at one of my stores. If you watch my last haul, or maybe it was my first haul, um, I found these out of town. They're the silver LED um, little tea light candles, and I need two more packages for the project I have in mind. I am like so close. But the one lady told me they only come around Christmas time, so these must have just been returned or something. But yeah, I need two more packages of these. I am on the hunt. I cannot wait till Christmas, so I hope I can find them. So yeah, that was one sad little lonely package by itself. And then I got the gray and white satin ribbon. You guys see me use this all the time because it totally goes with my current decor scheme. So one roll of each of those. And then I got, ooh, things are falling over here. I got three packages of these shower curtain hooks, except for these were not in like the shower bathroom section. These were actually by like the clothing hangers and they were on a little um, like plastic tab that was hanging on the side. And I bought one pack for one project, but it was like the other ones, I needed more. So I went back and only one of my nine stores actually carries these. So I'm worried that when I do the DIY for you guys, I don't know if you guys will be able to find these at all, but I bought three packages of those. Can you guys still hear me? I'm like super paranoid about that now. Okay, I got six packages of these clear acrylic gems and don't hate me. Every time I do something with these, you guys are like, oh, I can never find those. And I know, like I found six packages and that's between all of the nine stores that I go to. Like one was even just sitting down the toy aisle. Like who knows when these are gonna show up or where they're gonna show up. But when they do show up, I grab them because I use them for like everything. Yeah, you need to, I know, like they're so hard to find. Diamond Lee, Diamond, I love your name. That's one of my favorite names. But anyway, yeah, she says she can't find these. Like I sympathize with you guys so bad because I have a hard time finding some things too, but they come up like every couple months or so. So it's like, I'll buy, I'll see some at one store and then a couple months later, I'll see them at another store. It's not like they're always there all the time. It's like different stores have them at different times. So I sympathize for you guys that only have a couple of Dollar Trees in your area and you can only have like find so many things. So yeah, I always pick those up when I see them. So if you see them, grab them. And this is kind of not a normal purchase for me. Uh oh, these bowls are stuck together. I got two of these silver dog bowls. So I have a project in mind for those. Um, I'm hoping like the other piece that I can, that I want to do with this, I can find at the Dollar Tree. If not, I might have to do something else. So anyway, Melissa says that she's been to six Dollar Trees and can't find, oh, the organizers. Melissa, only one of my stores has those clear acrylic organizers. So I like... I don't know what the deal is with Dollar Tree. They're so sporadic with their stock on stuff. It's very frustrating from time to time. Um, next up, I got these three. Um, these are like the succulent garden bowls. They're plastic. I got three of them, but I think I'm going to return these because I ended up finding these bowls that I think I like a ton better I, for the project I have in mind. So I bought three of these ones as well. Like I said, I think those succulent ones are going to go away. Texas doesn't carry a lot. I know, I tried to find them, Melissa, online because somebody mentioned to me, they were like, why don't you just buy the stuff online instead of driving to all your nine stores? I'm like, well, duh, that's brilliant. So I like, I'll go to my stores and make my round and like pick up the things that I can. And if I can't find them, then I'll go online. And you're right, those acrylic gems are not online. And I looked even for like these clear shower curtain rings online before I went trying to chase those down and I couldn't find them either so yep okay moving right along um let's get these out of the way because they're kind of messy i got six feather boas in the white and these are kind of becoming hard to find um they were like really stocked up at first and now they are um coming and going and so when i see them now i grab them and i got six so let me read some comments for a second Oh yeah, Diamond. Okay, I noticed that. Diamond says that you can only buy bulk online and that is so true. A, they don't have a lot to choose of, like she said. And it was like a case of 24. Like, okay, I do DIYs, but I am not like, I don't need 24 of something. So anyway, you're totally right, Diamond. You kind of have to like bulk buy some things. Okay, next up, I got this clear glass jar and these came out like a month or so ago and I really wanted the square one, but I didn't have an idea for it at the time, so I didn't buy it. Now I have an idea for these bottles and I go back and they only have the round ones. So if I see the square ones again, I'll probably exchange this, but this will have to do. But it's like a delicate balance. Do you buy it like because you like it, but you don't have a use for it, but then it might be gone. It's like, I don't want to be a hoarder, but I don't want to miss out on something. 
So anyway, that's that. And then the next items I got are these, these are the champagne flutes, these two, well, they're not flutes, they're just champagne cups. They're like wider and a little flatter and they have the silver on the bottom and then the silver on the top. And I really like these and I don't see them very often. So I grabbed two of those. And then I bought the wine ones. It's a pack of four, they're plastic. And I did a couple DIYs with these before. And so I bought a pack because I thought I might think of something else. So I grabbed those. Uh, Diamond says, look for the napkin rings for a bling tray. I'm stuck out, any ideas what to do instead? The silver napkin rings diamond, or is it the clear? Oh yeah, the silver napkin rings. They have square ones too. Are you putting them on the top or are you putting them like on the feet? Cause on the, if you're using the napkin rings for feet, you could totally use these as feet, but that's just an option. Anyway, okay, moving right along, I got two gift boxes. Um, they're in the silver, of course, because that's totally my own motif, but I think I might end up covering these. But yeah, I got two of those gift boxes for a DIY. Next up, I got one sad little succulent. They just restocked them, and there was one point when I was like buying all of the Dollar Tree succulents and then just never used them. But we have one that I keep in our bathroom in a little pot, and like the sun hits it and stuff, and it's kind of like faded and things. So I thought I'd just buy another one to sort of like spruce that little pot up. Um, yeah, diamond. Okay, so if you're looking for feet for the tray, you could totally use these, um, buy like two packages of these and just put them on the bottom. That would totally work. Or they have the square napkin rings too. Okay, moving right along. You guys know, I feel like I haul these every single time. I love these, like because they're practically styrofoam balls, except they're a lot cheaper and they have bigger ones of these than they do of the styrofoam balls at the Dollar Tree. So I buy those. Um, Okay, next up, I got two of these candle holders. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with them, but they were so cute. I'm like, I don't want them to be gone and then I never see them again. So I just picked myself up two of those. Moving on, I'll be quiet with the wrapper. So I bought these suckers. These are like ice cream flavored suckers. They have chocolate and then they have strawberry. And I keep these on our bar cart and I've only ever seen two bags of them. This is the second bag I've ever seen at the Dollar Tree. So I snatch these up when I find them. They're just like by themselves down the candy aisle. So that's that. And then I bought eight packages of these like moss ball or moss balls. They're moss rocks. So I bought eight packages of those. They're just in the floral section. They're usually there all the time. So yeah, I bought eight packages of those. Next up, oh, I was so excited to see these back. Okay, the Martinelli's just got restocked in my area and I bought 12 of the blood orange. I bought one and I drank it and I, we all, like my husband and I liked it. So I went and bought a case of 12 of the blood orange and then I bought 12 of, these are the Northwest blend of the apple flavor. And then they also had the red grape, but I only bought five of them because I know we've had them before but I wasn't sure if we liked them or not or how much we liked them. So I thought I'd buy five and then if we really like them, I'll go back and get more. I keep these stocked up on our bar cart. So that's what I do with those. Okay, next up I got, ooh, this was a new find for me. I've never seen this before at the Dollar Tree. It's like this iridescent tissue paper. Look how pretty it is. I don't know what I'm gonna use it for, but I'm like, I've never seen this before. And so I got that. Next up, I got this cube organizer and I got it in the green one. Um, we just got a fire pit recently and so I've been like saving our junk mail and like our newspaper that comes in the mail and stuff because my husband will use it to start the fires and it's just been like piling up next to our garbage can so I got this to see if I could start putting it in there. That's that. Okay, so, oh yeah. Hey, Harriet, that's a really great idea. Okay, I totally forgot I made a um, blinged out like elephant tray that I use the elephants for the feet for the glam tray. So diamond, maybe you could do that. Thank you, Harriet. I totally just forgot my own DIYs. Okay, moving right along. I got five packages of these silver like, well, there's silver in there, but there's also like red and gold. They're glitter sheets and I'm pretty sure they're adhesive. I'm hoping they're adhesive for the project I have in mind. So yeah, I bought five of those and only one of my stores had these. I seen people hauling these forever ago and I've been waiting and waiting, and so I grabbed five, not knowing what I'm gonna do with them, except for one project, so yeah. Hopefully, they'll come back around. And then I bought three of these. You guys have seen me like buying tons of these, but I'd bought a bunch before, and as I've been making my rounds to my Dollar Trees, they've been getting like 
less and less there and so I'm like so afraid they're not gonna come back so I'm like I'll buy three more just in case I need them it's this delicate balance I tell you between being a hoarder and like missing out on like an opportunity that they're never gonna come back to the Dollar Tree again so yeah I bought three of those uh, next up I bought a ball and this is a pretty big ball I've only seen at one of my stores they have them this size they have like the um, little soccer balls and the little like basketballs and stuff but this one's pretty large and so yeah I have a project idea for this but as I'm looking at it, it's like lopsided. Can you see that right there? <laughs> I might have to go exchange this or it might work anyway, but yeah, only one of my nine stores had these kinds. So I picked up one of those and moving right along, I got two packages of um, these candles. I'm thinking I'm gonna use these two for that whole like glam up Dollar Tree candle video maybe. So yeah, got two packages of those. And I got some glow sticks because we're having a lot of like barbecues and stuff now that it's the summer and we're hanging out with friends at nighttime. So I just thought it'd be fun to have some glow sticks. And I got two bundles of the hydrangeas. These are pretty like scarce in my area now. So I just saw two sad little lonely bundles. So I picked them up because these are some of my favorite flowers from the Dollar Tree. Uh, moving right along. Okay, sorry. I'm trying to keep up with your guys' comments as best I can. Okay, so I bought three of these packs of skewers. I may only need two for the project, but it's like the shower curtain rings. I don't wanna have to go find the other like package of them if I need them. So I bought three of them for a project. Well, actually I think I'm gonna need them for two projects. So, um, and the last Dollar Tree items that I got are these four clear vases. I'm actually gonna do it. Somebody commented either today or yesterday about a video and so I, gave me a really good idea. So I bought four of these. I had to buy two from one store and two from another store because like if you hold them up to the light, some of them are pretty scratched up. So I bought two from one store and two from the other store. So that is all my stuff from the dollar store. So like I said, if you were here at the beginning, we were on vacation last week and I don't have 99 cent only stores in my area. So when I saw one where we were, I stopped by and it's not like I thought everything was 99 cents, but it's not. But most things are 99 cents. Like I was really surprised at some of the things. It was pretty awesome. I was so, so happy. Okay, so these are the things I got. I got three of these little like glass flower rose arrangements. Like look how cute are these? I got three of them and I don't know, like I'm just gonna set them out for decor. I'm not gonna DIY them or anything, but I've never seen anything like this at Dollar Tree. I think they're so, so cute. So those are those. Sorry I keep bending down. That's probably annoying. Okay, the next thing I got is this tray. It's a little, well, it's like a frame, but I'm gonna use it as a mirror tray, I think. So yeah, it's just got this white frame around it and that's that and then look how cute this little thing is it's like a little oyster with a pearl inside of it and it sits on a mirror i'll open it up i opened it up before to see what it looked like but i'll show you guys out of the box now read your guys's comments okay look how cute this stinking thing is i have never seen anything like this at dollar tree i think it's so cute but like look look how cute this is I'm like so in love with this. I love that 99 cent store. And my husband was waiting in the car, so I was like trying to hurry and just like scan the area without taking forever. So I wish we had them near us. And then the last thing that I got is just this tray. It was a serving tray, but I think I'm gonna set it out and use it as a decor tray. So yeah, that's that. I really hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I'm gonna take a second to catch up on your comments. Um, okay. Got lots of goodies. Okay, I don't think I missed anything too serious. You have found, wait, you found these trays at the, at the Dollar Tree? Well, it's a frame, it's not a tray. I'm gonna use it as a tray. Cause I haven't seen them on my Dollar Tree, but I guess if you're in Canada, Thanks, Blondie Warrior. You're always so sweet. You always comment. It always makes me feel so good. That's awesome. The, the, I didn't know that they carried these like Dollar Tree. Like, I wonder if almost they're the same stores, but yeah. Anyway, I'm so glad you guys came, and I'm always happy to do this for you guys, and I try to do it like after I've been to my Dollar Trees a few times, but yeah. That's everything. I'm excited for the projects I have coming up to share with you guys, and I will see you guys very, very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.